back it's melanie or she shed scrubbers so today i am back with a one page layout using the gnomes for winter collection from close to my heart i literally just have this scrap piece of pattern paper left and some cardstock maybe a few bits and pieces of the pattern paper but not much not many stickers either um so i decided i was going to come up with a layout using what i had and kind of be done with this collection, which felt really good. So I have three photos of my son ice skating from a couple years ago. Um, I did not get on the ice because heaven forbid I fall because I'm not a very good ice skater, but my husband got on there and was helping. Um, and by the end of it, he, my oldest was doing pretty good. Um, but last year, unfortunately, between rain and then and then like a dumping of snow we just i don't even think the ice rink opened um it was just kind of a odd winter for it so we didn't get to get go back uh, but i have these three photos and i'm just going to line them across the page you can see that i did um kind of angle that pattern paper behind the photos um just to give it a little bit something extra else I guess um something different I suppose um and then I had two border strips left over on the sticker sheet so I used those as well and placed those at the top and the bottom of my photos I did double map my middle photo there uh I think it's periwinkle maybe is the color um so I had that uh cardstock kind of that scrap piece and that worked out perfect for there I will pop that up on foam tape I believe um, and then I had previously used a stamp set and used that same periwinkle and um, stamped out magical memories so I decided to use that for my title and what I ended up doing was cutting it into a tag um, I just I don't know once I did it, I didn't actually love the look, I guess. Um, I will add to it and it will help. It's just so white. Um, I kind of thought about adding another tag um, to the top. I'm going to be honest, I did this layout quite a while ago and I'm just getting around to the voiceover just because of life, you know? Um, and so... I don't know that I actually use that tag at the top as another layer. Um, I guess we'll find out together. How's that? <laughs> oh, man. I should have looked at a photo before I started this voiceover. Uh, that might have helped a little bit. I guess I didn't use the tag. So now I have a tag for another layout. Um, again, I'm just popping up this middle photo up on some foam tape to give the, the layout a little bit of dimension. Um, and then I did tuck the title tag kind of underneath that photo a little bit. Um, and it's not awful. I, do I just don't know that I love that they're kind of the background paper and that tag are angled opposite directions um again working with what i had which was not very much um so i think that's kind of why i don't I, I don't love the layout i'm glad that i used up the collection um and had pieces that like worked for ice skating you see that gnome at the bottom has ice skates on and that's kind of why i decided to um use this collection for this layout now that circular sticker towards the left that I placed there, there is like a warming house um, at the ice skating rink. And so I just thought that was appropriate and cute. Um, so I am going to kind of add to that as well. Just really try to use up what I have left on the sticker sheet that would work for this collect or for this layout, I guess. So the tag and the other saying down at the bottom right, um, and then the heart and the kind of cabin and the bottom left. And then I bring in these acrylic snowflakes and kind of scatter those. I really wanted to use those up as well. Um, again, really just trying to finish this collection, kind of get it out of my stash. Um, I did have just a few pieces left over that I did kind of throw in my son's stash. Um, but for the most part, there's not really enough for another layout, nor I'm not, I, I might, uh, ruffle some feathers, but I don't actually love this collection. 
I bought it because I was selling close to my heart. And this is one that I just, I don't love. Um, I don't love the gnomes. I added it to this layout, um, but I don't know. I just didn't love the stickers or the pattern papers for this one. Um, so I am kind of actually happy that it is done and gone, I guess. I did decide to cut out some snowflakes. Uh, I have a snowflake die from close to my heart. And so I am going to cut those out in the periwinkle. And I believe that maybe mink or mist, that color there. Um, so I did cut a couple different sizes, a couple different colors, just to kind of scatter throughout the layout, just as maybe some finishing pieces, along with those smaller acrylic pieces. So I did add a smaller um, periwinkle snowflake to the bottom left cluster, and then I'm going to add some to the top uh, as well. I just, again, didn't love how bright white uh, the title was. So I felt like by adding some snowflakes up to the top, that would kind of help add some extra color, um, extra elements too, I guess. So I did overhang the larger snowflake and I just had to go back and kind of cut that off. Um, I don't know. I had, I think, one more large snowflake left over that I had cut. Um, again, I did it so long ago, I don't remember if I even end up using it. Um, one thing I do remember is that on camera, I use up almost all of the acrylic snowflakes. Um, but off camera, I actually do finish them off. Again, I did not want to store two teeny tiny acrylic snowflakes. So I just added them to the layout after, um, after I quit recording. So I did use that larger snowflake at the top um, kind of to, I don't know, maybe close off that title a little bit and just to get it used up. So here's kind of where I scatter these acrylic snowflakes, kind of just all over. Um, try to group them with what I have on the page already. Um, but once I get those done, I believe that is going to finish off this layout. So unfortunately, again, this layout or this collection is older, so it is not available anymore because Close to My Heart is no longer running. But I hope this layout kind of gives you some inspiration and you can kind of run with that inspiration. So I hope you guys enjoyed this layout and we will see you next time. Bye guys.